Joe's coming to show me Harper's outfit and my battery's dying. Do you like the outfit that daddy picked out for you, Harper? Back too. Yeah, oh, you wanna show the back? Oh, the back. She got a ruffly butt. <laughs> do you have a ruffly butt, honey? You do, are you hungry? Is daddy gonna go feed you? Okay, I love you. Happy Saturday, Joe is having um, a friend to come visit. He's gonna be here um, around noon and they are actually gonna spend the whole day together. So he's just been taking care of Harper this morning, making sure he's not walking by behind me without his clothes on. Um, so he's just been taking care of Harper this morning to spend time with her since he'll be busy for the rest of the day. So I was trying to think of what Harper and I could do today together and I thought it would be fun to finally decorate the house for fall today. So Joe is gonna bring up all of the, oop, that didn't work. That, mayday, mayday, abort, abort. He brought up all of these bins, so I'm excited. <laughs> I feel like my parents went south really quickly today. Why is it so dark? So I have something with the kitchen that I want to do. I'm kind of copying my Pinterest. People always say I'm really creative, but I really just copy Pinterest. <laughs> A little secret of mine. Oh, those vases are much bigger crud so i saw this on pinterest if it'll focus and i was like "Ooh, i really like that so i'm going to attempt keyword there to recreate it for the kitchen and i already have some burlap so i'm just gonna do that real quick see how that looks okay so that's what it looks like so far <laughs> Um, I really don't want to cut this burlap, but it probably looks pretty stupid like that. So I'm gonna grab the rest of the stuff that I have for this real quick. Okay, so I went to Walmart and I was trying to find little candle stands because in the picture it has four candle stands, two big ones and two small ones. And I could not find this anywhere. So I got these two lanterns that I thought were really, really pretty. So I could do that. I don't know which one I like better. So I have this that normally goes on the fireplace, um, but that's already decorated over there. I did that in my last video. I'll show you that in a minute. So one year I just bought a bag of corn kernels and it's a really fun kind of fall filler for like vases and stuff. So every year I just put that same bag inside of a Ziploc bag and then I have it to fill vases um, and things like that every year. So this is what this came out to look like. I'm actually really, really happy with it. Um, in the Pinterest one, it had two of the flowers, but number one, I only have one of these flower sets. So for me to do two of them, I was actually gonna have to run to the store and pick up some more um, stems of leaves. So the nice thing is that now I don't have to go to the store just doing it this way. So I am really, really happy with it. I just added some orange candles to the little lanterns that I already had in my fall box. So I'm kind of going through my bags or my boxes and taking stuff out. Um, I definitely don't think I'm gonna use all of this stuff. Kind of every year I end up using different things. I never end up using all of it. But some years I use that wreath and then other years I use another wreath and that wreath just kind of stays in the box. So every year is a little bit different. This is the Halloween mantle. I added this little banner after my video. I just got these little bats from the dollar store um, and it came in a pack of five. We are actually gonna have a little Halloween party with Ben and Sarah this year. So that's another reason why I'm kind of trying to decorate for Halloween a little bit more since I know that we're gonna be having a Halloween party. So in my video, if you haven't seen it, I will link it down below. I made this wreath and then I made those um, three vases all inspired by Pottery Barn and then I just made this banner from scrapbook paper made this banner from the dollar store bats and then just added some spider webs. And here is baby Harper just chilling out, playing with her little book. Huh, yeah. I think her schedule is switching up again. She's supposed to be napping right now, but she's not. 
<laughs> so I kind of just put her in there just for some quiet time. So I think for the kitchen, I'm just gonna decorate this little area. I did like this little guy here, but he doesn't technically fit. So let's see what I can put over there. So I decided to just put a jack-o'-lantern in that guy, which I think is what I did last year, and then I pulled out one of my cake stands. And then this painting I actually got from Anna, um, from Randy and Anna. I will link their channel and her Etsy shop down below, and I love this painting. Um, it was something that I was really excited to pull out again this year. When I redecorate the mantle for fall, I might switch things up a little bit because that little painting I think I put it on the mantle last year and I really loved it up there. So um, things might get switched down a tiny bit when I um, just decorate for fall and get rid of Halloween. Do you ever look at your holiday decorations and you're just like, I had no idea. <laughs> so much stuff. So I have a ton of garland. That's one strand. This is two strands. There's two strands in there. And then another strand right here and then another strand. <laughs> but these guys, I'm gonna put inside of a vase. She's just playing on her activity mat now. I fed her and changed her, and then put her back down, and she's just playing with her little toys. I put her in here, since this is where I'm working. All right, I'm gonna put these in there. Boom. Hey, Amber. What you doing? You playing with your toys in there? Watching mommy decorate for fall? When you're older, we're gonna do this together. You excited for that? I'm excited for that. So that's what that looks like. I might switch out the white candles with more fall colored candles. And then the last thing I'm gonna do with the kitchen is just putting something on here and then I'll be done with the kitchen. Okay, so I have the kitchen done. I've been working for like an hour. I just like didn't know what I wanted to do this year. in here I kept it pretty basic. I definitely want the um, fireplace mantle to be the focus and we spent a lot of time in here so I definitely don't want to be fiddling around with too many decorations. I have dead flowers right there <laughs> but I am going to replace them with like sunflowers or some kind of fall flower and then I have a fall candle there and then I just switched out the pillow with a big orange pillow and it's kind of like a sweater pillow. And then over here, I just have some um, little owl dudes. <laughs> so I'm gonna put her down for her evening nap and then I'm gonna give the monitor to Joe. He's downstairs with his friend right now. Um, and I have to run a little errand and then I'm gonna come home and finish fall decorating. So Uncle Ben and Aunt Sarah are coming over to visit with Harper tomorrow and then also Sarah's brother is coming to visit Harper as well. Um, and they are getting here like pretty much right as we get home from church So I just don't have time to like really cook anything um, So I'm gonna go to nothing but cakes and pick up just a yummy little cake for us to eat and then she's gonna bring um, Like a little appetizer. So we're gonna have like appetizers and cake <laughs> uh, When they come to visit which should be really fun and then I'm gonna come back and decorate the living room and the entryway This one woke up early, huh? Did you wake up early? Are we in focus? Are we in focus? I don't think ah. that we are. Oh, that was a burp. So this is the fam or the living room all finished. I did kind of just minimal stuff over here. So over here, I just did. Um, I had this little fall centerpiece, and then I put the little pumpkins on top of the candle stands or the candlesticks and then just added a couple more pumpkins. And then over here, I kept it pretty basic as well. I just added the lit can or the lit pumpkin 
a little basket, and then a pumpkin over there. So this is the entryway table. Again, I kept it pretty basic. I just added some garland and then I added those little acorns and a candle. decorated that was really fun it definitely different than last year because last year I was able to just like set aside a couple of hours and decorate the house whereas this time I had to do like 20 minutes here take care of Harper 20 minutes there take care of Harper <laughs> which I am NOT complaining so anywho um, like I said Ben and Sarah are coming over tomorrow and it's actually my brother's birthday in a couple of days so I stopped my target really quick um, when I was out grabbing the cake and got him a gift. So I'm just gonna wrap that so it's ready for tomorrow. So I just got him this green sweater. Unfortunately, I don't think I have a bow, but that's sparkly enough, right? I am definitely tired, I was just falling over. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and end it. That is legit a bag of dirty diapers on my counter. There's only like two in there though. Um, I had two dirty diapers laying around so I grabbed a new bag and then I'm gonna go empty her trash bag in her room of the dirty diapers. So I put it there so I can wrap a present. Anywho, um, <laughs> I am gonna go ahead and end it here.